the LAV-700 armored personnel carrier was developed by General Dynamics Land Systems, of Canada. It is an improved and modified version of the LAV-6.0. It has a larger hull, is better protected and can carry more payload. Also the LAV-700 is fitted with a more powerful engine. Saudi Arabia ordered 900 of these new armored vehicles in various versions. Production of the LAV-700 commenced in 2017. The LAV-700 has a different hull than its predecessor. This armored vehicle weights 21,000 kg and has a payload capacity of 11,000 kg. So the LAV-700 has growth potential. It can be fitted with various turrets and add-on armor kit for a higher level of protection. This vehicle can be fitted with ceramic add-on armor kit for a higher level of protection. So ballistic protection is scalable, depending on the threat. It is estimated that maximum level of all-round protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. It is estimated that front arc withstand hits from 30mm cannons. Cage armor can be installed for protection against anti-tank rockets. Vehicle is fitted with automatic fire suppression and NBC detection systems. Though NBC protection system with overpressure is optional. Also there is a laser warning system and shot detection system. This vehicle can be even fitted with active protection system. The LAV-700 has a double V-shaped hull for protection against land mines and improvised explosive devices. Furthermore this vehicle has adjustable ground clearance, which can be raised to the highest level when the vehicle is crossing areas where mine threat is high. Crew and dismounts are seated on energy-absorbing seats. Currently the LAV-700 is one of the most protected armored personnel carrier in the world. Once fitted with a powerful armament, it can be even considered as a wheeled infantry fighting vehicle. The LAV-700 can be fitted with various turrets or remotely controlled weapon stations. A baseline version is fitted with a 12. 7mm machine gun. This vehicle is proposed with 30 or 40mm turrets. This armored personnel carrier accommodates around 6 to 8 dismounts. Troops enter and leave the vehicle via a rear power-operated ramp. Also there are roof hatches for firing or emergency exit. The LAV-700 is powered by a Caterpillar C13 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 711 horsepower. It is a huge improvement over 450 horsepower engine of the LAV-6.0. The engine is mated to an Allison automatic transmission with 7 forward and 1 reverse speeds. This vehicle retains its driveline and independent hydropneumatic suspension system of the LAV 6.0. Ground clearance of the vehicle can be selected from the driver's position. On hard surface roads it uses 8x4 configuration for maximum range, while 8x8 configuration is engaged over difficult terrain and off-road. Two front axles are steerable. The LAV-700 is fitted with a central tire inflation system and run flat tires. This armored vehicle can be airlifted by AC-17 Globemaster 3 or Airbus A400M military transports.